So the Girls Advisory Council is a great opportunity for young ladies to uh, gain the self-confidence that they need, the uh, empowerment to speak out when they see injustice. It's a wonderful experience. We're like all girls of every age to learn a little bit more about the history behind women's equality rights. It brings together like-minded people to talk about important things. Um, that usually you wouldn't talk about anywhere else. Things that are often silenced, like gender mutilation and child marriage, and to really learn from people who are really knowledgeable on these topics. The talks that we talk about are topics that I knew about, but I never really knew that much about. Living in Alice's legacy and meeting with the girls in the Girls Advisory Council has helped give me the strength and courage I need to be my own person and to be a leader for other girls. You're off to great places. Today is your day. Your mountain is waiting, so get on your way. It's just great to have a community where you can talk to people and um, share ideas that are similar. At each meeting, the girls learn about different issues that face girls and just women in general around the world. And we talk a lot about equality issues and problems that they face. And hearing, like, people around your age talk about it really changes like the way you see it as opposed to just like reading an essay on it. You get to have conversations with different dynamics and stuff. GAC has brought me so many good um, opportunities. I've got to go to the UN. Through my involvement in GAC, I was able to attend the Women's March on Washington. I held a sign that read, I am an, I'm a Muslim and I am an American. And I got stopped a lot for that sign, and GAC gave me the foundation to be able to talk about what I believed in and talk about my faith and my religion confidently. During my first year, I attended the Women's Equality Day celebration here at Paulsdale and was able to meet the former U.S. Treasurer, Rosie Rios, and the former U.S. Chief Technology Officer of the United States, uh, Megan Smith. After giving her a gift bag with the Jail for Freedom pin, she mentioned to me how it would be great if someone made a 3D printable version so that other people could make their own. I discussed with her how I was going to an engineering academy at my school and I would be having a computer aided design class later that year. She gave me her card and said email her the file when I completed it. A few months later, after completing the pin, I emailed it to her and was thrilled to hear a response. I received an invitation to attend the dedication of the Seoul Belmont Women's Equality National Monument in Washington, D.C. I was recognized during the ceremony by Valerie Jarrett. I also was able to hear former President Barack Obama speak live about the issues of income inequality and women's rights. Hi, I'm Taylor Kane. I'm a freshman at the George Washington University. I'm majoring in political communication and I'm minoring in women's studies. Hi, I'm Jean Cornell. I'm an original GAC member from 2003 to 2010, and I'm a graduate of American University from 2013. I joined GAC because I wanted to be around like-minded girls who were passionate about the same issues that I was, and I also wanted a safe space to talk about these issues. I think what I'm most impressed by GAC now is that it's so much more organized than when I was in it. For us, we were able to drive and really create programs on our own, but there was no real um, set meeting time or uh, timeline of when to accomplish things. So that really is more of a cohesive group now that I'm just so impressed by that all these young girls are coming together to go on different trips and put on different programs that I never dreamed possible for GAC. Through GAC I was able to make great friendships and alongside all the girls in GAC we were able to fight for causes we believed in and be activists. GAC gave me the skills of organizing events, being able to work in a team to put things together. We really focused on teamwork um, to accomplish a common goal. I think GAC is really important for young women, especially because through it you can develop your networking, public speaking skills, and your confidence. And I know everyone that goes through GAC comes out more confident.